Exodus 20, 12b. Al ha'adama asher Hashem elchecha noten lach. Briefly review the context. We have honor your father and your mother that your days may be long. Continues, upon the land that the Lord your God is giving to you. Take a look at Notain. Well, this comes from Noon, Tav, Noon. Easy enough. And this is a call participle masculine singular. Now, in this case, it has the verbal sense of giving. The Lord is giving this land to you. When we come to this last word, lach, this is a little bit tricky. Uh, this looks like a 2FS pronominal suffix. Uh, that is, when we have the cha, that's the normal form of the 2MS, and the ch is the normal form of the 2FS. Uh, but this is actually a 2MS pronominal suffix. Uh, the land that the Lord is giving you. Because it's still the same male referent Israel that the Lord's been talking to here all along. So we get just a little bit of help here from Gazanius at 103F. So when we have the normal um, 2 MS ending, when it's in pause, then uh, we have the lengthening of the vowel to a comets, and it kind of pulls that vowel over. And so it leaves behind a schwa. So in other words, it's the saluk here that sort of changes the uh, shape of this. So this is actually a 2MS. Um, uh, the land of the Lord is giving to you, Israel. It's very interesting to consider what happens here when we attach this. Uh, so it's not just long life that's not an individual promise per se, but this you is a collective to Israel. Honor your father and your mother as individuals, because then you will live long upon the land that the Lord is giving to you. Uh, so there it's um, kind of there's an exilic threat that goes back to the basic covenantal responsibilities of obeying parents.